like the Pacific Asia Museum is getting some new art. Placing the uh, dragon piece that they had. It is cold. Holy cow, it is cold this morning. Oh, such a bad eagle rock design. It is like the worst design for a mall. Going down South Lake. It's just a little after 2 p.m. We still got a couple of hours before work I like this little piece of art that no one pays attention to you see what it is is a pigeon this US bank right here has uh, wonderful floating lights I do have a thing for hanging lights but floating lights these are the uh, most really cool ones love to you can't really see them in the sunlight but at night it's pretty spectacular a lot less crowds even for right now <laughs> the barriers so many folks have said, oh my God, I'm so glad this is all over and done with. Thing is the traffic. Let's back up Green Street, see how it looks. Waiting for the nosy neighbors to come to life. The donut shop. Paul Mitchell School. You can literally smell the hair care products.
Now this is the Playhouse District. Meso Laboratories. The Jacob Marcy Flores. I want this building. Pasadena Playhouse is on our right. This one building right here alone is just, wow. This would be a great house. This one too. And then Cali Express, opening soon. Making a lot of head turns. Really taking notice too. Here comes automation in the food industry. 2024. I'll wait till they're open. I'm not in a rush to see people's jobs disappear. Still, former Le Cordon Bleu school. Kitchens, actually, too. These were the teaching kitchens. All right here, too. Now, uh, the Institute Culinary Education. This used to be a bank many years ago. I just can't remember what branch, what institution. Let's go look for Wi-Fi and kill some time before work. I don't hear any strikers. I like the colors, but it's just, uh, hotels used to have lavish planters and flora and fauna. 
more than just a potted plant. Kids used to love to come here and play with the little fountain shooting up. Very dystopian. There are so many shops that were open. This was, oh God, the offspring, I can't remember now what. It was fun. <clears throat> it was a clothing store over here for girls or for women, but it was usually, <laughs> and they'd come over and chat up a storm over here, get free samples and stuff. My store, formerly. And so many businesses have come and gone. I can't remember, but it was either this one or this one. I'm, I, I don't know why I'm more inclined to think this one it was a sharper image. <clears throat> or I think that brown one was. <clears throat> BBW was there. Has been. And Brighton Collectibles. They've, they've been here throughout the whole thing. And so it's a Tony's or Tommy. <laughs> uh, they pretty much didn't stand a chance. what's left it was all but a dream and a nightmare for many heard this morning over the news that one of these uh, Pasadena business people pocketed the tits of Pasadena employees I'll put that one down below, it's funny.